Oh. Hi everyone. Ah! Hate introductions. I can never know what to say. Obviously, hi. Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. I say that as if I'm like an actual YouTuber but I only have two videos so I don't know if that counts but here we are. As you can probably tell by the title I'm doing a Sheen haul today. I think that's how you say it. I don't actually know. I'm really bad at pronunciation so don't butcher me for that. Your girl spent about £140 on Sheen. To me, that's a lot of money, but I know to some people that's not actually that much, but I never spend that much on clothes, so this is a big deal. I've been literally debating buying off Sheen for about a couple of years now, but I never wanted to take the plunge because I always thought like their sizing is going to be so weird. But for the past six months, I've really debated it because I've been seeing all over like YouTube and TikTok, like everyone's been like doing sheen hauls and buying off sheen and you know so many people have got decent stuff off there so i was like fuck it this is my first haul by the way so please don't judge me so yeah that's what i'm doing today i'm going to show you everything that i got um and i've already tried all the stuff on but i'm still giving you like my first impressions slash opinion but i'm just going to insert the clips of me trying it on and talk through everything that i got as we go along tip for you i would say definitely check the reviews for each individual product because people obviously say like if it runs small if it runs big i literally had to eyeball everything on the website obviously i checked the reviews and everything but i just really had to guesstimate all of my sizes so first things first i'm the realist i'm gonna start off with what i'm wearing because it's probably a good place to start isn't it so this is actually from the haul, this top. First impressions, the material is actually really nice. Like, it's just like t-shirt material. It's not too thick, not too thin. The only thing is, is I will put the prices and the size that I got on the screen. I think I got a large, maybe? I don't know. But it's actually massive. Like, it's, it's so big and oversized. Like, it is an oversized fit, which is good if you want, like, an oversized fit, but you could you can literally almost get away with it being a t-shirt dress like it's not as long as a t-shirt dress but you know if i was to wear it with jeans i would literally just like do the whole tie top thing if you know what i mean or just wear with cycling shorts which is what i'm doing right now first impressions i actually really like this i've got nothing bad to say about it at all it looked exactly the same as what it was on the website the second item that i got was this cute little tank top I've got this really cute tie-dye print and it's in this like aqua blue slash green color and i think it's really nice um as you can probably tell from the clips it's a tiny bit see-through like you can see my bra outline but it's not a big deal at all this fitted so well like it was the way i exactly wanted it to fit um sometimes these tops can come like a bit loose or whatnot but this was literally like as you can probably see so fitted and i really liked that the quality feels great like there's literally nothing to complain about at all um i don't think it feels cheap or anything i would say this is this is actually better than i saw at first because i got a um, tie-dye co-ord from them a few weeks ago and i had to send it back because it just looked awful and the quality was awful and this is so much better than that so i'm really happy with that i also got it in purple slash lilac so i really liked both colors and i thought i might as well just get both why not um and yeah literally no complaints it's the exact same as the other one they both look exactly how they were advertised on the website and on the model like so accurate there's nothing to fault about them at all so i'm really happy with that I as well just like continue with the top section as I'm already on top so next up I got this long sleeve flared mesh top and um, it's hard to show because it's like a wrap round top if you know what I mean but as you can see it has this really nice sun star moon space print on it I think this is so cute I was really shocked when it arrived that it was a wrap around and you had to tie it because I don't know why but I didn't expect it to be like that 
like maybe I just didn't look at it properly enough on the website but I thought you would just kind of like put it over your head and wear it sort of thing but I actually really like that because you can sort of like alter it and make like cinch your waist in sort of thing so I like that so this was in a large so a 12 to 14 and this fit really well it wasn't big or anything but if you I, I would maybe say size down in this top a lot of the reviews said size down so that's why I didn't go for a 16 I thought right I'll go for a 12 to 14 then and it was perfect I personally wouldn't need to size down anymore but someone else like might need to so if you're in between maybe like a six to eight i would say go for a six sort of thing so yeah the only fault that i could probably say is that the length on the sleeves are so long but like it's okay at the same time like it's not actually a bad thing because it's it's the style of the top like it's just how it hangs that's how it's like meant to sort of thing but it is kind of ridiculously long but i do have short arms so moving on we have another top ah, i think this is so cute i am into like japanese stuff and like anime and i just thought this print was just really cute and a bit of me i like the little i don't know what you call i guess like petals um going along the top i think it's just such a cute little detail obviously i tried this on with a bra with straps um i would ideally wear this with a strapless bra if i had one but i don't so whatever as you can see it is a little bit see-through but it's nothing too major like i still think you can get away with it a lot of the stuff in this haul that is white is the tiniest bit see-through but like it's it's not an issue for me this fitted really well um i believe this was in a size large as well i just realized i've already got tan on it how bad is that what the hell that's what you get for being a fake bitch the material is 65% cotton and 35% polyester yeah so that's why it feels a little bit different hear me out i feel like you could layer this though you could maybe put a turtleneck on underneath and just have this on top that could be a vibe that might not be a vibe you know i don't know though so i guess i would say like it's a versatile piece this next item is probably the only item so far that i've tried on which was a bit disappointing so it's this little butterfly crop top um it has like the lettuce hem edging i don't i don't know i'm trying to pretend i know what i'm on about but i don't fucking know what i'm on about it looks really cute it looked cute online and everything and you know i look at it now and i'm like that's cute but i think this is probably one of the only items where i did size up and i think i've got an extra large and i really wish i didn't because if i got a large which is 12 to 14 i probably wouldn't have had any issues with it but as you can see i don't know if this is just because i'm a bit short or something but it's really stretchy on the arms like it's a very stretchy material which is good but on the arms it was like a bit too big it wouldn't fall down or anything like i could definitely get away with still wearing this and i might still wear it like i don't hate it at all or anything but it's not my favorite piece like i feel like it could be fitted better but i feel like also it's my fault because i should have got like a smaller size but i think they didn't have the smaller size so i just thought fuck it i'll get the bigger size it's also quite see-through compared to everything else that's like um a lighter color or white in the rest of the haul this was probably the one that was probably the worst see-through i guess so yeah but look it's so stretchy yeah okay so that previous top i said obviously i got an extra large and i was like oh this is probably the only thing i got an extra large i lied um this next top i did actually get an extra large but it actually fitted okay um this is the top it's very cute it's a cute little baby blue crop top with a butterfly on and it's got short sleeves as you can see um it's just like a normal cotton material whatnot i would say this fitted just as well as the other tops i have no complaints about this one i think the color is really cute for one of the pieces that are bigger i guess like this is a bonus so i don't if i had got it in a large i don't know if that would have been a good thing or a bad thing sort of thing i've got nothing to complain about i still think it's cute they do this in so many other colors as well so 
I might get it in baby pink because pink is always a vibe. Right. Right. I don't know why it sounded like that. The next top we have. Cute. I know. It's this little cute crop top which has the little... Oh, what is it? It's like, it's called a lettuce hem, isn't it? Someone correct me if that's wrong. I got this in a large and this was fitting. It did fit, but right. I don't know if anyone watching this has seen Jordan Lipscomb, I believe that's how you say her name, um, her sheen haul, but she got a top that was similar to this and she said that it was fitted all at the top, but past like the boobs to the stomach, it just sort of hangs and it wasn't fitted. And I literally found the exact same with this. I'm a bit curvy or whatnot. I feel like it did fill out the top a bit more, so it doesn't look as if it's hanging that much on me compared to what it did on like Jordan Lipscomb or whatever but I'm just saying that I had the same like problem it's not really a problem but as you could probably see in the clips I would prefer it if it did fit a little bit better like it fit to my skin rather than just sort of hang a bit awkwardly but yeah this is in a large and it did fit it's very stretchy i still think this is cute got nothing bad else to say about it like i love the color i think the color is so cute and it looks so cute with denim um but yeah that's just like the only thing that i would tweak a little bit so this is the last top in the top section of the haul and this is pretty much similar to what i've already got on here we have it I love the colour of this, um, I just think this like teal blue is such a nice colour um, and obviously it has the dragon print on it which is like in gold and the gold itself is like the, you know, like a foil printed or whatnot or whatever you call it. The comments I have for this are the exact same for what I have for the grey one. Um, it is, it still has that oversized fit and whatnot and I would probably just wear it as like a t-shirt dress or with cycling shorts um it is a nice oversized fit um th with this top i did have the intentions of it being a t-shirt dress anyway because i'm pretty sure on the model that's what it was like advertised as if it is a t-shirt dress like if i've got this wrong and it's not a top and it is a t-shirt dress it's quite short for a t-shirt dress you could wear it both ways though it's versatile like wear it as a oversized top or as a t-shirt dress so yeah moving on right now i'm going to go on to trousers i got three pairs of trousers i didn't get any skirts or anything else i literally just got trousers these are the trousers um i think these are fucking wicked i would so wear these to a rave i don't know if anyone like watching is into rays or anything but i do think they are like a cool piece to wear to a rave like with a crop top or a bodysuit um as you can probably hear the shell is it shell like um yeah it's, it's shell right it has like a floral print on with dragons as well and obviously as you can see like it's black and the print is like white it has a cool seat belt belt like a buckle um, the only thing is, is like, this part of the belt just hangs down, like, there's nowhere to put this. Unless I'm being dumb, like, maybe you could, like, wrap it in or something and tuck it back in. Um, so that just hangs, which doesn't really bother me, but at the same time, like, it might get, it might just get a little bit annoying, you know? So I got these in a size large, and to be fair, out of everything, the trousers was the thing I was most sceptical skeptical about fitting because i just thought i got a fat ass and that's not going over my booty no for real i do have like bigger thighs and stuff so i thought i don't know how this is gonna fit but i thought they actually fit really good the only thing else that i would say is a little bit like uh, um <laughs> is i love the fact that they are like a cuffed they're cuffed at the bottom like i love that but they do puff out a lot at the ends like no like fucking parachute legs over here but it's not an issue or anything you kind of get that with shell stuff and maybe it's because i have short legs i don't know this next piece this next piece this was the main reason why i wanted to do a sheen order was because of these 
these really cool lightning bolt print trousers um obviously they've got purple on them these are just so cool they're pretty much the same material as the other trousers they're like that shell material um i just love the color i love the print like i just think these are so wicked like you might have seen them going about on instagram or whatnot like they are kind of like a trend or whatever but i just think they're really cool they're so cool to just spice up just an all black outfit or just like i don't know is they are so lovely fitted like they have elasticated waist but they still like suck you in and hold you in and everything um they're not loose or anything and they're still like cuffed at the bottom and everything <sighs> i don't know if it's just me and it's just my body but they're just a tiny bit tight around the gooch area just a tiny bit they're high waisted so they come up and everything which is great that's how i want them to fit but they just kind of pull a little bit on that area but seriously they do but it's nothing that's uncomfortable or like an issue but it's just like i would rather be a little bit looser there but then i don't know if that's just my shape and that's just me so this is the last clothing item but i have i still have other things to go through i have a lot of accessories and stuff so don't worry the last pair of trousers i have are actually some joggers and i was skeptical about these as well because joggers i mean uh, pretty little things joggers are amazing i love the way they fit and everything like they're great but overpriced in my opinion boohoo i mean a lot of clothing brands are really hit and miss with joggers in general so i thought mm, i don't know what sheen's gonna be like uh, but i just thought they looked cool and as you can tell i like dragons apparently but yeah this is what they look like they're black with neon green um dragons on the top of the legs and they have a neon green drawstring as well which you can use to sit your waist in they do actually tighten up which is good and the bottom of the joggers are cuffed as well which is also a bonus got these in a large as well and i genuinely have no complaints about them they're the fit and the feel of them i wouldn't say are as good as pretty little things they're a bit more on like the jersey material side if that makes sense maybe i might be chatting shit who knows i still think they feel great and they're good quality and everything they're not cheap and thin like they're exactly what you pay for and i have nothing to complain about really i just think they're really cool um i do have a mesh green dragon bodysuit which i think kind of look a bit sick with this but it also might be a bit over the top but i am extra so it doesn't matter okay accessory time i got a bag this is the bag <laughs> i think this bag is so cute i just love the fact that it has the little chain detail on it like i think it makes it different i love the color like i'm just so into lilac at the moment i don't know why um i will say it does feel cheap i'm not gonna lie like it but then i don't know because if i got this from boohoo it'd probably feel the same yeah it doesn't I don't know it feels a bit cheap to be honest and it probably looks a little bit but it was it was cheap so i'm not going to complain about it at all i just think this is so cute because you can literally just wear it on your shoulder it's got a little brim um which is good i think it's a good size because although it's like a little bag it's still good because i could literally fit an actual person here as well as like my phone keys and other bits this is still in the packaging but ah, ah. if you know me you know that i fucking love cow print i just think it's so cool it's so funky and it just like jazzes up your outfit or whatnot but i thought this was cute like you know i wanted a tote bag because i thought i have so many like bum bags handbags backpacks but not like a, just an easy throw on your shoulder and get out the door bag and i live by the beach i'm aware not everyone does but i thought a tote bag is so handy for the beach 
I'm saying that as if I leave the house. I don't. Yeah, take to the beach, just chuck like a towel, sun cream in and all of that. Yeah, I think this is cute. I think this was about 11 or 12 pounds. Sticking with the whole I love purple at the moment thing. I've got some sunglasses. And I actually was really impressed that these come in a little case. Like, I thought, that's such a cute little touch. Like, I didn't expect them to. And they look a little something like this. Woo! These aren't practical sunglasses. I am a sunglasses collector. I don't even know if you can see, but behind me. But I like to collect sunglasses because when I go to, like, raves or whatnot, I just like to pop them in my head you know i just think they're such a cute accessory so like you know you can match it with like what you're wearing so like for example if i was wearing like the lightning trousers with the purple bag and the come on you already know it's a vibe yeah i just think they're cute they're just a cute little accessory the next pair they didn't come in a case but i think it's because they're a weird shape like they had to be laid flat i mean What else can I say? I mean, just they are such a vibe. I think these are such a vibe. My mum saw these and thought, what the fuck are those? And I get it, but they're just so cool. They're like a neon green colour and they have like flames coming off the ends. And I just think they're such a vibe. Take a shot every time I say vibe. Drinking game. Like these I really would wear to a rave. If I've got like a green outfit going on, definitely stick these on the end or on my head just completes it it just completes it i believe these were cheap as well probably about four pounds or whatnot and yeah i've got nothing bad to say about what they're like or whatever they're just sunglasses do you know what i mean so i got a bit of jewelry why does it sound like bottle caps like i don't know if that's concerning or not Let's start with the rings. As you can see, I'm not over these. Oh, it fits. <laughs> That's a start. Look at that. I don't know if you can see because my fat head's in the way. I'll do some separate clips of these on. But this is like a big skull. I think this is so cool. And in this pack, comes it comes with three. And I'm going to try and put them on. Sorry. Oh, that one's a bit tight. They're really chunky. I like chunky rings though. My hands are so small. Please don't judge my fingers. They're so stumpy. But yeah, <laughs> my fingers. No, I think these are so cool. I don't know how much they were. These are quite big though, to be honest. Like I have um, chunky fingers. That one's, sorry. I don't... Ooh, but seriously, the middle one, that one is a bit tight though. They fit me alright, but if you have small fingers, these are going to be fucking massive on you, mate. Let me tell you that. Um, I also got some more silver rings. So, we have some more. These I thought were really cool because they're a bit different. Try and get... Oop. We have this. Cute. It says angel on it. Oh my god, that's so small though. What the fuck? I don't know if any of these are actually... Oh my god, that's really small. Oh, okay, it fits that finger. Fits that finger on me. But on the others, it's a bit small. Sorry that I'm looking into the view finder. I'm just self-obsessed. Then we have this sort of swirly pattern with like a... almost has like diamonds. It's not diamonds, but like, I don't know, in. Um, this one has a little sunflower on, which I thought was really cute. These are really small though, guys. I'm not gonna lie. I do have big fingers, but they are quite small. They still fit though. Like, they fit. Um, I mainly got this because I liked this one because it had a little padlock on. Okay, so these mainly fit. Like, so this one is the biggest one, but the other rings mainly only fit that finger and probably my pinky. Yeah, and my pinky. So they are quite small. So if you have like just skinny fingers, they'll fit you, but if you have fatter fingers like me, <laughs> they're not gonna fit all of them. But I just think they're kinda cool, you know? The only thing I would say is they, they do look cheap to be honest, like, I don't know, they just look like they've been painted silver. 
I don't know, but oh my god, guys, I'm not, I'm not even joking, I, it's stuck. Oh my god, look, can you see? Oh, thank fuck for that. <laughs> Got some necklaces. Start with the silver one. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, they're all separate. Love that. I thought it was like a set thing, which put me off a little bit. So we just have like a silver chain, which, you know, cute standard. Love that. I thought these come all attached together like a layered thing, but they don't. They're separate, which I think, I think, I think it's better because then you can like just wear whatever ones you want. We have a smaller chain, which has like a massive paper clip on. And then, this is my favourite one, it has padlock and keys on, which is so cute. Let's try and put it on. This is going to be a disaster though. Okay, so first things first, the clasp doesn't work. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to press the little clasp bit down and it won't move. Well, that's good. Um, so I don't know if I'm ever gonna get to actually wear that necklace. <laughs> Got another necklace, which is gold. Um, oh, it's upside down. So I don't know if you can see, it's like gold chains and it has um, butterflies on and it says angel. See, this one is all attached together. It's like a layered um, necklace, but it's attached. It's all one thing and it's tangled to bug. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I said the necklace said angel, it doesn't, but it says brat. Stupid butterfly. Guys, I don't even like butterflies, by the way. I don't not like them. They're pretty, but I'm really scared of them. Like, I'm scared of moths and butterflies. Like, moths are just disgusting, but butterflies, like, when they come up in my face, I'm like, literally i'm like fight or flight mode this is cute yeah i like that i think that's a cute little addition we're nearly done we're nearly done okay next we have some little hair accessories so i got some cute little butterfly clips like i said there's a lot of butterfly like theme going on in this haul i don't know why i just they do look cute they look cute I like to colour coordinate quite a lot, like outfits and accessories, so if I'm wearing pink or whatever, I'll put the pink butterflies in my hair and stuff. Um, yeah, they do look really cheap, to be honest. And the second like hair accessory thing I got was some elastic bands, which are cute. Um, you have like multicoloured ones, and then on the back you have pastel ones. I don't know if you can like see, but they're cute last but not least we have some phone cases and you know how i said i like cow print yeah it had to be done it just had to be done i also got you can't see uh let me oh the second one i got is this like Celestial? Is that how you say it? Celestial? I don't know. I'm an astrology whore, so I like planets, space, stars and shit. So I thought this was cute. And obviously the cow print speaks for itself. I currently have this phone case on my phone. I think it's so cute. Like my friend got me this for my birthday and it says Taurus on it. Like it's just so cute. And it's my favourite colour, pink. But I wanted some just like black and white cases to match with some outfits. Like I said, I care about accessories and stuff. So if a phone case like, you know, ties in my outfit a bit, I'm just like, chef's kiss. That's everything. Um, final thoughts and review on it all. Um, I'm so happy, like, <laughs> no, I'm so happy with everything. Like I'm genuinely shocked that everything has fit. Like there's only the butterfly crop Top. it's the only thing that i would send back but i'm not gonna because it's not worth the money all the time but there's literally like nothing in this haul that i want to or need to send back which i just think is like 10 out of 10 like that's so good well done sheen you did it you did it sis but i think if you're really debating ordering from them just do it like just try and stick to your actual size like you know if you are bang on a 10 stick to 10 um and you should be fine so just be a typical youtuber if you did like this video and give it a thumbs up because just be nice just 
just do it. Like, just do it. You're already here. Like, if you've literally got to the end of this video, you might as well. Yeah, so if you did find this helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already, subscribe to my channel. Can't make any promises that I'm going to be consistent with uploading now. Because, like I said, I only have two videos anyway. But stick around there may be more content coming soon i really hoped you enjoyed this and i hope this did help some people and i don't know this was fun to do so bye